Welcome back guys, Patrick here. In this video, we have to discuss whether these two expressions are the same. So negative five to the power of two where negative five is in brackets, and then just negative five to the power of two. And I discussed this in one of the examples in previous videos, but the answer, the short answer is that these are not the same. So negative five to the two, you can rewrite this like that. Right? Negative 5 in brackets times negative 5 in brackets. And what does that give you when you multiply it? it? Gives you 25. Now this one, because the negative 5 is not in brackets, you're only taking this 5 to the power of 2. And then you're multiplying that expression by negative 1. You have to do bed mass. So you can rewrite this as negative 1, positive 5 to the power of 2. See the difference between these, right? There's a negative one here in front. So whenever you see something like this, just put that negative one in front, and then whatever that number is, take it to whatever that exponent is. So five to the power of two, that ends up being 25, and then we have to multiply by the negative one, so that ends up being negative 25, right? So the answers are different, so they're not the same. So just be careful. Notice the difference between these. When it's in brackets like this, then you multiply it, right? Negative 5 times negative 5, it's 25. But when it's not in brackets, there's like a negative 1 in front. And then the 5, only the positive 5 is to the power of 2. So you got to do bed mass, you got to do the exponents first. So 5 squared, 25 times negative 1 gives us negative 25. Now, these would be the same if the exponent was an odd exponent. So for example, negative five to the power of three and then negative five to the power of three. The process is still the same. This would be negative five times negative five times negative five. But because this exponent is odd, when you multiply these out, we get negative 125 here. Then here, it's still negative one, and this is five to the power of three. So this would end up being negative 1, this would end up being 125, positive 125, and then negative 1 times 125 gives us negative 125. So when the exponent is odd, they're the same, but when the exponent is even, so if this was like to the 4, these would be different. This would be negative, this would be positive. So just be careful with even exponents and when you see that difference. 